Okay, palette. So, okay, let's make sure we're ready to go here. And did you have time to practice in the vacation? Yeah. Yeah, good. Good, because we want to move you right along as quickly as we can go here. Okay, and how's your A? Additional lesson, and then how's your P and A coming along? Okay, Dad. Good. It's fun to work on, isn't it? It's like a real project. Okay, let's do. How about stop bows with your scale? Yeah. And I love 
lost my trusty metronome. Here it is. Okay. And we're going to put it on 60. And how about we do 2 plus 2 for both? So 4 notes for both. Yeah. Oh. 
right click, go on, and then when you get here, just go to the top thing. We'll skip the measure, but just start here. Next time we're gonna play. I'm gonna move the markers. Yeah, how's that? We're gonna play them together, but still slow, beautiful shift. Just wanna try that. We can do a few, few of them. Frog still. We place them together. Good, good. Good. Let the ball keep moving. Good. Now, add, just like in your scale, as you're playing here, be anticipating where the fingers go. I don't want to wait till the last minute, so I'm anticipating. It's really good practice that way because as you're going up, I have to know this is a major six. I'm going to a minor six to a major six to a major six to a minor six. So again, I'll anticipate them. So maybe just go from here. But let's we'll go up all the way here. And minor six, uh, major, good. So as you're 
we're playing the F, be anticipating the openness. Good, good. Open, good, A, minor, good, minor, good, major, good. One more. Good, and E. Good, but then you keep shifting up. Good, and we can come around a little bit, some really loose. Good. That's very good. Good? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. I heard it yesterday, it was good. Okay, so then very connected here. Okay, same thing. And how are your octaves? Good? Yeah. Okay. Clean with. Just from here, we'll go. Oh, how about this? Is start from here. We'll make a shortcut again. So we'll go. And my fingers so light. general rule with octaves is that the first finger is going to be heavier and the fourth finger is almost like a harmonic. bigger margin, we're going to have a better time playing in two. Okay, so let's do all of them. You can do them still separate, but then together also. Okay, how about your quotes or etudes? Are they stuck? Mm. Okay. And we're doing number seven. And do we start eight? Take it again. 
clips in there yet. Okay, well, it's okay. It's okay. Seven, there's plenty to do in number seven. Okay, so let's do seven. Um, you're doing these different variations here. Okay, first, let's just do our cole at the frog. Take the low back, right, like a rudder. That's good. And then can we go on at the frog tip? Good. Now, I'll get out of your way because I don't want you to feel that you're going to change your violin to change the level. So, you really need to go from the arm to change the level. Up, good. Up, good. Up, good. 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 And let's go on. Up at the frog, down at the tip. Up, down. Up. Good. That's good. Does it feel comfortable here? Okay. Let's try just a little for review. Up. Staccatos again. So we're going to play. Uh, drop it, drop it. Good. Now, with the drop it, so the staccato, just let the bow drop, you know. Okay, and how 
about with this one here. So we're going to start always from the string. Good. Now, I, you know, you do amazing things with your bow and very soon you'll get a bigger violin with a better bow. But you don't want to be too close to the frog. So, you know, find maybe a little bit more here. Good. Let, let me just see your bow. Let's see. Every bow has a special place and your bow is about a little too tight. So... In general, it's going to be at the balance point. Let me show you what the balance point is. Every bow is like you put it on a scale. And that's sort of where it's going to be. also so you might copy them out but for next time we're just going to Very good. And let's do the second ding. 
you sitting? If you 
we're going to experiment around. It's move the bow slower and you get a scratch, right? So do it slow and get a big scratch. Well, that was pretty good. Do it really slow so you get a big, ugly scratch. That's right. Now move it too fast. That's good. So we want to find the right speed. And we start from the string. Good. A little slower. Right. We need the G, the D string also. Good. So you're going to want to put the bow good on the lower string too. That's it. And then just move it a little faster. Good. And next chord from the string. Spot. Good. Good. Not too fast. The bow. Spot. Good. Next chord. Good. So and a. Not but from the string. Good. And next chord. string and we can do good next one good next one good so and we want to circle so I'll get out of your way good 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 and again we'll put the bow on the bow on the string. Up, down, up, down, up. Good. That's how to practice. Good. So then we're going to shift on the down bow. Good. And we keep the bow right in the string. So our code is S, down bow four. Bow. Yeah. Good. Yeah, pop, pop, pop. Good. Now we're going to keep a beautiful. Now, F sharp here, 
very fast beat. Open. One. Three. Four. 
finishes that section. Right? That was really good. And now let's just make sure you have this. A and and A. Good. So what you can see what's happening here, it's very clever. So you go A, A sharp, you go up B and another half step and finally the last half step C sharp, right? Okay, so let's go through A again. exactly how to, that works. Then are you practicing with the sixes yes. and then rhythms? Yes. Okay, good. But now you understand how the fingers work. So let's do one more variation here. How about
this week let's start here and I'll hear this next week first sis and then we'll work that oops oh good cat almost and then we'll do your second page and then your first page just keep practicing everything but start your practicing there and I think you know next week is the last lesson but I'll give you a lesson right afterwards while you're still in school and we'll have the whole thing okay okay questions no. no. Okay. Are you going skiing this Christmas? Uh, I think we are, but like only for two days, and it's really close to like Christmas. Yeah. Day. And if it's no. Yeah. Yeah, that's a big. That's the big if, isn't it? Yeah. Okay.